Glaucoma is a common eye disease that affects the optic nerve. Fluid in the front of the eye does not circulate and so doesn't drain properly. What causes this blockage so far remains unknown, but this lack of drainage causes a buildup of pressure within the eye. This is known as intraocular pressure, or IOP. When the IOP is high, it causes damage to the optic nerve, damage that is not reversible. Therefore, it's imperative to reduce the intraocular pressure. The most common treatments range from prescription medications, such as eye drops, to laser procedures and surgery. Some of these treatments carry with them many adverse side effects, so alternative forms of care have been researched. Research was started in the 1970s to see if the active ingredient of marijuana, tetrahydrocannabinol, or THC, could lower IOP, and the resultant studies were supported by the NIH, National Eye Institute. They found that it did indeed reduce IOP by about 30% for three to four hours, peaking at the two hour mark. When it comes to late stage glaucoma, with its corresponding pain and nausea, many doctors are frequently recommended recommending cannabis to treat or alleviate these symptoms. However, the future of cannabis is not only to treat the symptoms of glaucoma, but to also stop the progression. Scientists are testing cannabis containing eye drops for topical use that are showing positive results in lab tests. These eye drops hope to reduce the effects of glaucoma and stop the progression. Visit our website, CannabisMedicalNetwork.com for more information.